in a kind of deeper and deeper risk the more you go past the 1st of July. That would be my thumbnail guess. It's expected that next year a longer application window will be available to farmers and more will be selected to plant the crop. This is a story with a lot of layers to it. So we're bringing in John Kipper, who reported on this story for mm -hmm. us. And John, with just a week long window late in the season, 176 mm -hmm. farmers still applied. Right. Why do you think such interest? Well, Jenny, the Farmers Union told me yesterday that the average farm family in Nebraska is losing money every year. They're in the red. And so they're trying to find any alternative they can, along with corn and soybeans, to try to make money. Now, that being said, this is no silver bullet. They don't think it's going to save every farmer in Nebraska, but they do think it's one piece of the puzzle. So a lot of farmers apply. The state only licenses a certain number. Mm -hmm. Why is that happening? Why doesn't everyone get a license? Well, that's because this year is going to be a little bit of a trial run. The main reason for that, it gets a little complicated. The 2014 Farm Bill that Congress passed only allowed hemp to be grown for research reasons, but 2018 Farm Bill changed that. So next year, um, farmers are going to be allowed to sell the hemp for whatever purposes they want. And um, uh, not just that, though, but some farmers don't exactly want uh, all these different farmers, hundreds of thousands, maybe thousands of farmers to get licenses a year because they don't want, of course, a flooded market. Sure, that makes sense. Now, when we're talking about the